In this video, I'll show you how to search using CINAHL headings. In CINAHL, the subject headings are called CINAHL headings, and they're assigned to every article by CINAHL based on its content. Using CINAHL headings in your search will help you to retrieve more relevant results. To use CINAHL headings, ensure that the Suggest Subject Terms box here at the top is checked off. This will let the database suggest CINAHL headings that it thinks are appropriate based on what you've typed into the search box. For example, let's enter the term nursing homes into the search box and click search. At the top of the list here, we can see that nursing homes is a CINAHL heading because it's hyperlinked. Theoretically, articles in which authors use different words, such as convalescent home or long-term care facilities, will be indexed or tagged with this subject heading, thus grouping all articles about these types of care facilities under the same subject heading, making them much easier to find. There may also be other subject headings that describe our concept, and we can see a few more here below, but for now, let's move ahead with nursing homes. Sometimes the term you enter won't have an identical CINAHL heading, and instead, the CINAHL heading suggested may be a synonym for your term. If you want to make sure that the CINAHL heading suggested is right for you, click on the hyperlinked term. This will show you the full tree for the term. Think about this view like a hierarchy. At the top of the list, we have the broadest term associated with nursing homes, which is facilities, manpower, and services. And at the bottom, we have the narrowest term, skilled nursing facilities. Your selected heading will appear in bold in order to help you see its place in the hierarchy. You can also view CINAHL's definition of the term by clicking on the small speech bubble icon here on the right-hand side. This is also known as a scope note. To add a CINAHL heading to your search, you can choose whether to explode the term or not. To explode the term, you can click on the box to the right of your term here in the explode column. If you choose to explode a term, the database will automatically search for either the term you selected as well as any of the narrower terms found below the term you selected. These terms will be combined with OR in your search. In this case, the only narrower term is skilled nursing facilities. If you do not want to include the narrower terms, or you only want to include some of the narrower terms, but not all of them, you can select them individually here on the left-hand side by ticking off the boxes. As you can see, both of our terms have appeared in the box here on the right-hand side, combined with OR. CINAHL will also prompt you to select subheadings. The option selected by default is to include all subheadings, which we'll leave selected. Now, sometimes there are additional subject headings in the hierarchy that you may also want to search in order to find all articles on your concept. So let's go back to the term list by clicking here at the top, and we'll try and pick up an additional subject heading. Let's say we're also interested in nursing home patients. I'll click on this term to get directed into the hierarchy. We can see here that it doesn't have any narrower terms. So I'll click on the checkbox beside it to add it to our search, and it will be combined with OR. And then I can click Search Database. Now CINAHL's run our search, and it's also added our search line to our search history. So we can continue searching with other headings now by entering them into the search box at the top here. In the next video, we'll talk about searching with text words in CINAHL, and I'll show you how to improve your searching using truncation.